you're always going to find 50 degree temperature both winter and summer under the ground. Yeah, but I don't know many people who think that 50 degrees is a comfortable temperature to keep the house in the winter. Right, but that's where the heat pump comes in. We're going to use the basic refrigeration cycle that we see in every window air conditioner, every refrigerator, even to cool our cars, to use that 50 degree water to make your house comfortable. The water or antifreeze is pumped into the heat pump, and in the winter, the heat is transferred to a closed loop of liquid refrigerant. That refrigerant now goes into a compressor, which uses electricity to compress the liquid refrigerant, turning it into a gas and making it very hot, maybe 130 to 150 degrees. In a typical forced air application, air is blown across the coils of that hot gas, heating the house. The refrigerant is then cooled by the air, and it turns back into a liquid, and the process repeats. The same equipment can be used to cool the house in the summer, simply by pumping the refrigerant in the opposite direction. 